What is up guys, I'm Nightspeeds and welcome back to the channel and today we're playing Skate 3. There's been two videos of Skate 2 which was very refreshing for me to play but we're back with Skate 3 because we're going to do something you can't do in Skate 2. We're going to go to another custom park I built. So we're just skating the ghetto spot right now because I sort of tried to go for the same vibe at the spot I created so let's just go there so I can show you. and. <laughs> The names for my parks, I don't know what I'm thinking when I when I create these names, but this spot is called Brick Anna. Yeah, that is weird. <laughs> but part of the name, the brick part, is, as you can see right here, a big part of the spot. So originally I wanted to make tiles like this right here all around, but no matter what I did, I just couldn't connect them without it like glitching out. You know, it's just the, the grass banks or grass corner, I think this is, put together in different colors to make this funky pattern. I, I kind of like it. And this is actually my favorite part of the park, but let's just start off. I don't even know where to start with this one. I guess we could start with the starting point. You, you drop in on this quarter pipe, kind of DIY-ish, and we got a little extension here. And then we got some pretty cool gaps because some people placed like a metal thingy that you can grind over and also a rail over this sewer thingy. Do I say thingy a lot? But then, then you go down here and you can skate this flat bar someone brought here. That's like a broken tile ramp so you can go up again. So we got this little pole jam here which I haven't really been able to skate properly. I have done tricks into it and grind down it so that's kind of cool. We got this yellow flat bar dividing the place. And what's cool about that is we have a mani pad here so you can you can grind over it, you can grind it and then land in a mani or you could just do a manual here. So I really like that about it. Here we have another little ramp thingy. I do say thingy a lot. God damn it. <laughs> but we have another ramp over here which is just like the roof and then someone put coping on the edge here so you can actually do tricks there. Now it is kind of hard to skate because you have to like turn in here and you don't really have a lot of time to set up your feet but this thing is also here. I don't know if it's cool or anything but it's there. Then we got this little round mani pad. We got a weird ledge here which is just you know the bank inside and also guys no merch glitch. I have to say that every time I make a video because I can't do that. This is on Xbox One. So we got this little dirt segment here hosting some trees and kind of dividing these two areas. I've never really skated over here to be honest. I don't see why I should do that but I mean it's there and we got like a Barcelona bench as they call it but I'm pretty sure they tried to recreate the, the Saints bench and these are just like twice as long as they are in real life as far as I can remember from being there. I've been there a couple times but we got some of those benches around here and then we got this very cool area. I really like this place. Got two out rails. Is that what you call it? I, I don't even know but you, you can get pretty sick on those and you got a rail drop down to rail which is also pretty interesting to skate or you know you could just skate the stair because it is cool looking stair you can hippie jump through here we should actually do that you can skate the flat bars here looks pretty cool get over here maybe hit up this ledge maybe hit up the mani pads rail but then you come down here to the lake that you can grind all the way across down here to this little chill bridge place where you can sit and hang out in the beautiful environment but yeah, I, I don't even know. Maybe the water is coming out of this sewer thing. I don't know why it's this clear. I actually need to make the water here darker, I feel like. Yeah, this is pretty good. Now it looks more like an actual lake. Let's start out with a line over here where we take one of these golden rails and then just make it down to the lake grind. What just happened? I gotta play that back. So we come... Okay, kick the back lip, we're gonna take that and let's get a trick on the rail here, that's fine, that's not fine. <laughs> Once again with the kick the back lip and we're landing so sketchy, it's horrible. Quick little nolly heel, how about a hard flip to manual. Oh, and don't mess this up, please, Night Speeds. Or go ahead and mess it up. 
a little kick for back tail, not rotating enough out, but it did make it a little easier for us. All right, we'll, we'll count that, but then we'll also do a trick here just to make up for it. Hard foot manual, and then if I mess it up one more time, we're not going to do the line. All right. Oh, <laughs> we made it down here, so let's just capture that on film real quick. All right, let's check out the clip. So, kickflip back tail actually looking really good. I'm surprised about that. And this one was accidental, so... Oh, that actually looks really good. And then I popped way too high into that one, but... This one was pretty good. I like that hard foot manual. And then the, the front side board slide over the lake. Looking really insane. I'm actually really happy about that line. That was sick. So let's get a trick on the rail that's going over the little sewer thing over here. Or should we start out with something on the DIY quarter pipe? I guess we could try that. I can't remember how it skates though. It skates pretty good. Kickflip back disaster. Nice. And then I jump over the rail. That was a shame. That was a way too high frontside flip, but we are going to take that. And then you bail a nolly lip. We can take that. I don't even care. But then that happens. Oh my god, come on. Because I have to take a tiny last push. Nolly big heel back nose blunt. Don't mess this up, night beats. I was planning on going over the rail, didn't you know that? Uh, Alright, but I think a tiny push as the last one is what helped us there. Oh, beautiful. We got it again. Don't mess it up this time. Oh, that was also pretty cool, but now I took too big a push, but I'm not going to do that. I'm going to skate this. Wait a minute, we can't just have these floating around over here. What the heck, night speeds? To a disaster. All right, the camera's being weird again. Kickflip front lip, and we'll just cruise around here and then try a nolly inward heel flip to a manual. Beautiful. And then we can just, as a joke, try to hit the rail in the end. Oh, going way too fast, but we got it. I mean, I did one with the nose blunt more, but I'll take what I can get, thank you. This trick on the quarter pipe ain't gonna look too good, but whatever. How's the filmer even going to film this part? What? That was a weird, weird filmer glitch. All right, I filmed it now, so let's just check it out. I do have to warn you about the first trick in the quarter pipe. It might not look very realistic, but let's just check it out. All right. Now, a little too popped, but I mean, it's better than I expected, actually. Kickflip front lip, where I actually cut the wheels a tiny bit, but I don't want to worry about that too much right now. Nolly inward heel to a manual, that's awesome looking. And just a quick heel flip manual on the round mani pad and then to the nose grind over the leg rail I think I showed you all I really wanted to show about this spot here I mean it is a pretty small skate spot but you can definitely do a lot of different stuff there's a lot of variety you can pull on those lines and you know we didn't go up here we didn't skate this and we didn't hippie jump the rail as I said we were so let's just do that <laughs> There we go, second try. It's been a while since I've just filmed a trick completely static angle. So let's do that. There we go, the hippie jump I promised. You know what, I think I'll get some more clips, maybe as some of the pros as well, and then I'll throw in a little montage right now.
I hope you guys enjoyed that montage and just, you know, the entirety of this video because I think that was it. If you did enjoy it, please leave a like. That would definitely help out my channel a lot. And then remember to subscribe and hit that bell. And then I'll just see you guys in the next video. Thank you so much for watching. Peace.